in failing to be able to succeed if you use it in a, in a right if you use it in the right way it can help you in many ways and what I mean by that is what I've been able to do within these last couple couple of weeks other than getting my mind set back into focus mode clear it's just vision 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 I had to review what I did within the last six months so I was pumped I was excited to do what I wanted to do but the momentum of me pushing forward was lost because I, the momentum didn't, didn't wasn't wasn't kicking forward and it wasn't building enough traction. So what I've learned is next three months that I push now, what I've got to do is I've got to put a system in place. I've got to put a system in place and I've got to I've got to forecast what I'm gonna what's gonna happen in the future and adjust my life to it. So for example, the first month it was good. Then it was November, I was getting closer to December, I was still working hard. I noticed when it got to December last year, um, it was getting good to Christmas and I kind of went, I kind of went into comfort zone. And then January, I just, I felt like I've just lost momentum. February, I was trying to get back on, on back on the horse. March, bang, I just got to make it happen again. What I'm going to do for the next three months, there are two things that I'm going to focus on. I'm going to forecast the meaning, I'm going to plan ahead within these next three months, I've got to make sure that this energy that I have now continues through the three months to the six months and throughout my life. Okay, so meaning uh, Easter's coming up, uh, my anniversary is coming up for me, or anything like that. And then after that, with those times that where I feel like I'm going to fall off track, or I'm going to lose momentum, put a system in place to protect me that through Easter and through my anniversary that I don't lose momentum. So maybe I have to do a bigger workout or maybe I have to train and do a second session within those times to be able to fill up for those times that I'm going to eat a lot of chocolate. You know what I mean? So these are, these are some of the things that I've known that I need to apply that I've learned from the time that I failed. So my, my, what I'm trying to say to you guys is you're going to fail, fail, fail. I'm failing. We're failing every single day. But learn from it. Forecast ahead because you know what you did in the past. Put a system in place that you feel is going to be better and to keep that energy going and you'll benefit from it. So very, very excited for that. I'm definitely going to keep you guys in touch, keep you guys um, updated with my journey. Um, and I feel that this is going to be something really, really good. You know, one of the most exciting things about life is, is the journey itself. And I think that's where we need to stay focused on. Um, enjoy the journey towards the finish line and not just on the finish line. Alright, so stay in touch guys, please, if you, if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel, subscribe to my YouTube channel, um, and I want to give you more content, more content, more content, and just, and just be real with you guys.